In addition to coordinating growth, the endocrine system also regulates your body's metabolism. The most important metabolic reaction involves the oxidation of glucose, the process that gives you energy to move and grow. When your body is at rest, glucose and oxygen are delivered to your cells at a relatively low rate that just meets their energy needs. This is your basal metabolic rate. But physical activity requires extra energy. Now a person's metabolic rate must rise to as much as 20 times greater than at rest. Several parts of your endocrine system work together to meet these changing energy needs. The process begins within an organ that mainly functions as part of your digestive system, the pancreas. It produces digestive enzymes. These flow through ducts into the small intestine. Scattered among the cells of the pancreas are about a million tiny clusters of cells that are quite different from the usual pancreatic cells, the islets of Langerhans. Like all glands of the endocrine system, these islets secrete their hormones directly into the blood. When the glucose level in your bloodstream rises, the islets secrete a hormone called insulin. Insulin regulates the concentration of glucose in your blood and its use by your cells. Within the cells, glucose is oxidized and energy is released. By controlling the metabolism of glucose, insulin keeps the glucose level in your blood from getting too high. The more glucose there is, the more insulin is produced. Another hormone from the islets has the opposite effect. This hormone, glucagon, stimulates the liver to release more glucose into the bloodstream, making it available to all your body's cells.